We are in the alert mode as we go throughout the next uh, 24 hours at least. Uh, anytime you see the red icon, it means that dangerous weather is happening. For tonight, it's not because of tornadoes or hurricanes. It's the incredibly brutal temperatures. Windy tonight, 6 degrees the low in the upstate, minus 1 in the mountains. That's going to make it feel like sub-zero temperatures with the wind. Greenville's at 21 right now, 23 in Spartanburg. Clear skies, you can see it on the SkyCam network. Eight right now in Asheville. Our sky cam network over Greenville. It is a frigid night in downtown 21, but it feels like nine with the wind still howling around. As we look at other temperatures around town, it's already four in Cullowhee. These are air temperatures and really quite the problem as we go into the overnight hours as the teens uh, settle in and then eventually the single digits. It is breezy as well. 10 to 15 mile per hour sustained or persistent winds gusting at times up to 30 miles per hour. It's those gusts that really cut to the bone, right? That's making it feel so cold. It feels like nine in Greenville, seven in Anderson, minus 10 in Asheville and minus two in Hendersonville. As Griffin told us earlier, uh, frostbite can settle in in 20 minutes with these type temperatures to the exposed skin. So you really want to be very careful out tonight. Look out for your neighbor and bring those pets indoors. Tomorrow morning for Christmas Eve, we'll wake up to between 5 and 10 degrees in the upstate. Minus 2 expected in Asheville. A hard freeze for sure. And throughout the day tomorrow, plenty of sunshine, but temperatures, they just don't budge a whole lot to near freezing. That's about it. In the Asheville Hendersonville area, you'll get out of the single digits to the teens by lunchtime, only topping out at 20 for a high. Look at the wind though. It stays up all night long, 15, 20, 30 mile per hour gusts that stays with us through the day tomorrow. And that's going to make the wind chill oh so cold. As we map out tomorrow, morning's wind chill values as low as minus 5 to minus 10 in the upstate, as low as minus 20 in the mountains. Again, so dangerous to be outside. The good news I have for you is the temperature is looking up. There's always hope on the horizon, right? And here it is. We've got a well above average temperatures expected for the first week of January. Temperatures could be in the 60s most days. The four day looks like this. It's an alert day for Saturday. Dangerous wind chill values starting off at 6, warming up to 30. Christmas morning, we're starting off at 14 degrees, but warming up to 38. Unfortunately, Monday is going to be a telling day if you had water damage or not. That's when your pipes will begin to thaw. And if you have water, that's because of those pipes thawing and breaking. We'll be in the mid 40s by Tuesday. We're pushing 50s by uh, Thursday. Western North Carolina minus one tonight, 21 for a high tomorrow, nine on Sunday. Hard to believe in one week's time frame, you'll be pushing 60 degrees from one extreme to another, right? Wow.